Hey there Warriors, I wanted to show you the simplest and quickest way to update all your packages on some project. So this is my textual games project, I chose this one because there are a bunch of dependencies here and I want to update them all with just one command. So I'm going to open my terminal here inside the textual games directory and I'm going to use npm update. Now what is the problem with this command? It updates all the dependencies but not the major versions. So here for example if we check clerk it's now 5.7.1 this would update it only to 5.8, 5.9 but if we had a new version of clerk 6 it would not update that one. So what is the solution with npm is that we can take package by package, go inside our terminal and write npm install and then this one and that one is going to install the latest dependency for us but that is kind of silly to go and just type in for each package npm install and we have like a zillion packages. So that's why pmpm created a better solution for this problem. For example, there is pmpm up and that one is doing exactly the same thing as npm update. So it is basically updating all the dependencies, but not the major versions. And we can see now that it's updating everything. So this one is finished and we can see here, for example, eslint, it's still 8.57, but 9.12 is available. So this one it marked it as deprecated and all other are fine so there are no any other major releases for any of our packages so this is a great solution but what if we want to update all our packages to major versions in that case pmpm has one handy command and it's pmpm up latest like this and now it's forcing all the packages to update to its latest dependencies. And we can see now that ESLint is upgraded from 8.57.1 to 9.12.0. So now we know in this specific situation that Next.js is not supporting ESLint 9. So we are going to our package.json, we're going to find ESLint and we can put here like it was before 8.57.0 and now we can go here inside of our terminal and just run once again pmpm install and now all of our dependencies are being installed and we can now here check the changes so we have only package.json and pmpm lock and we can just add everything to git and commit so here we are going to do it as chore and then empty here and we're going to say let latest dependencies and up to latest, just like this. And now everything is being committed, everything is good, and we are just going to push it to our repository and everything is fine. This is definitely the simplest way for me to update all of my dependencies and just be aware that you have to know a little bit about your packages. For example, here I knew that ESLint 9 is not working with Next.js, otherwise we would have errors, so you just have to be aware of your dependencies and this is just one command that you can run and everything is going to be updated. I hope this one was helpful, until next time, Loktar Ogar!